So anyway, a few weeks ago, I almost drowned. I was at this lake having my first swim of the summer. There is this like jumping platform thingy that everybody was jumping off. So I thought, what the hell, I might as well try it too. It looked like fun. Apparently, I hit my head on the way down and I was knocked unconscious. I woke up lying on my back, back up on the platform with a whole bunch of people standing around me and this weird 40 year old something, 40 year old guy like pressing down on my chest. At first I had no idea what was going on, but then the man who had revived me told me that I had been underwater for almost two minutes. He said that he had been lucky to get a hold of me down there. A small part of me was happy to be alive, but the rest of me was screaming inside. I can't believe he just felt that he had the right to just grab me under the water while I was knocked unconscious. I wasn't able to consent. He thought it was perfectly okay to just grab my body and pull me in whatever direction that he pleased. He possessed my body, and he grabbed my waist and pulled me around down there like it was his right, like he wanted to fucking have sex with me down there in the water. Fucking aquatic sex. I feel so violated. I can't believe it. He raped me. You're saying that I can't work, have a hairstyle because of your culture? Yeah. Why? Because of my culture. You know what belongs to me. Do you know it was in Egyptian culture? Are you Egyptian? No, nah, but I'm not. Are you Egyptian? No, but then you're not. Wait, where's Egypt? You know what, girl? Where's Egypt? Here you go. You have no where's right to tell me Ooh, what I can wear. Huh? Where's Egypt? Yo, girl, stop touching me right now. Yo, girl, stop touching me right now. I'm back. Get off hey. me. What the hair I have? That's no reason, yo. I don't need your disrespect. I don't need your disrespect. Why are you filming this? Just everyone's safety. Why are you filming, guys? I'm setting up. Just interesting. Keep this on my blog. Yeah? yeah? Did you ask permission to film? Well, it's a free country. We can film if you want to. Yeah, well, it, if you have this attitude, then you don't belong here. Okay? Well, we film. You get the fuck away from us. Get the fuck away from us. I am the feminist who is out to ruin your life. I am the feminist who is ruining your perfectly respectful marriage by suggesting Audre Lorde to the book club that your wife attends. And yes, I am the one who convinced her to get that shorter haircut that you pretend to like but don't really like. I am the feminist who is pushing your daughter down the slippery slope of sluthood by giving her a high five when she says she keeps her own supply of condoms. And incidentally, I've tried to turn her bisexual gay by re recommending some dental dams. Yes. I am that hysterical feminist who demands trigger warnings on scenes of rape and violent sexual conduct. Yes, I am that militant, man-hating ball buster who insists on opening the door for you just because I made physical contact with it first. I am that ice queen cunt. The destruction of this scale is dedicated to all of the women whose lives have been ruined and ruled by it. This is for us, ladies. Safety first. Oops. I'm tired of you stealing my life. I'm tired of you making me feel if I'm good or bad. I'm tired of you deciding how my day is. No more of you deciding my life. No more of you stealing life from me. This is death. I take back my life. I'm in control. I decide if I'm good or bad. Nag you. I deserve a great life. This is about me. This isn't about you. Do you have but, another question? But have you ever had a, like a cock shoved up? No, place? I haven't. No, I haven't. Well, then great. 
Well, you know what? I, I've, I've, I've shoved my penis into my, my women, and they like it. Yeah. 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 They, tell me, they tell me to go to go rougher, deeper. to go harder. They say harder. deeper. They, they say, say deeper. deeper. Oh, my so, I love it. Oh, so all women want that. Hey, sometimes I sneak in through the window <laughs> without telling her unannounced. Sometimes she takes. So what? Are, what is your point, though? What's your point to be an upgrade? You brothers can get back. With, get back in. Is get that, back in line. Uh, yeah, you can get so away from your, the camera. You, so, so what's you, your point? Do you have any? Do you have any grievances coming up here? Of course I have grievances. So what are, can, state your grievances, please. That that all men sexually harass women. So so you're saying you so you're generalizing that all men sexually harass women. What do you define as harassment? Um. It, well, there, there's a kind of a broad spectrum. Between, kind of, right? She okay. never go ahead, go ahead. Shut. Shut the fuck up! You want to see the see, spectrum? So do, you, do you want to have do you want to have discourse or do you want to or do you want to use well, profanity? First, first <laughs> there's in, there's <laughs> interrupting me. <laughs> okay, I'll let you speak. Go ahead. Hi guys. You want to know something that I hate more than anything in this world? I hate men. I especially hate the men that say. Oh, I'm not like the last guy you've been with. I won't hurt you. I won't do that. I won't cheat. I won't lie to you. When in all reality, every single man is exactly the same. No one has proved me wrong yet, and I really don't think that anybody will. So when you're telling a girl that you won't do this, you won't do that, you better fucking own up to your word and don't do it. I hate that. I hate men, and I hate liars, and I hate cheaters.